demonetization in India by currency a revolutionary step to digital India. The demonetization of 501,000 bank notes was a policy enacted by the government of India on 8 November. Ceasing the usage of all 501,000 bank notes of the Mahatma Gandhi series as legal tender in India after 9 November 2016. The announcement was made by the respected Prime Minister of India Narendra Modi in an unscheduled live televised address at 2015, IST, on 8 November. Announced the issuance of new Y500 and Y2000 bank notes. However, the bank note denominations of Y100, Y50, Y20, Y10 and Y5 of the Mahatma Gandhi series remained legal tender and were unaffected by the policy. Demonetization was an effort to stop counterfeiting of the current bank notes allegedly used for funding terrorism, a crackdown on black money in the country, reduce corruption, drugs, smuggling. However, in the days following the demonetization, Banks and ATMs across the country faced severe cash shortages with severe detrimental effects on a number of small businesses, agriculture, and transportation. People seeking to exchange their notes had to stand in lengthy queues, and several deaths were linked to the inconveniences caused due to the rush to exchange cash. Also, following the announcement, the BSE Sensex and Nifty 50 stock indices crashed for the next two days. Share if agreed. The move received support from several bankers as well as from some international commentators. But it was heavily criticized by members of the opposition parties, leading to debates in both houses of parliament and triggering organized protests against the government in several places across India. When the government takes a historic decision like this, there will be short-term difficulties but that is for long-term good of the nation. Demonetization a revolutionary step it is leading to digitalization. Enemy is flooding our nation with these counterfeit notes. We need to put an end to this. Like 